Mayville is the kind of place where peace met quiet along the frozen Rock River and decided to stay for a while. So it's ironic that the city's largest employers make a lot of noise producing steel. But it's the metal behind the high school's iron curtain that's now making noise in this community. Mayville's very own heavy metal music. I thought it was weird, but after I went to the first program, I was just amazed. Kenny Voigt's daughter, Stacy, plays in Wisconsin's only full steel drum band. Casey Knoll started playing before she ever got into high school. And I thought it was really cool to be in something different. Steel drums are pretty rare instruments. Now, I've never like even seen these before, like when I started in. So to hear them play a rhythmic version of Amazing Grace in tiny Mayville? It's a long way from the Caribbean. Ben Reel is Mayville's Count Basie, a band leader, composer, but now a builder as well. They we're going to end up at Four Labs mobile station where I'm going to pick up some drums. Real searches all over town for the perfect barrel to make the perfect drum. Today he's visiting his friend Jerome Forlub, who's got a 55 gallon barrel that used to hold motor oil. You need to uh, look for the, the right strength or the, or the thickness of the metal. Yeah. Hey, this might be the one. It's a keeper. Back in room 302A at the high school, Mayville's band teacher of the last 32 years is one of only 10 or so people in this country to make steel drums. Someone said that it's more like making a strata various than just banging on a barrel. You gotta know where to hit it and how to hit it. In fact, that isn't too bad. Reel's a horn player by training, who five years ago fell in love with a different kind of metal probably what I, the instrument I should have been playing for a long time. They have quite a repertoire. They play everything from the Beatles to the Sesame Street theme with a rhythmic flavor that you'd expect from Jamaica, not from thousands of miles and dozens of cultures north in Mayville. After each concert, your kids are good. Yeah. The reaction's the same. Beautiful. They're like shocked. They don't know what to think of it. They're just like, why would they have this in Wisconsin? Even here in Mayville, where the drum band's been around for five years, people still can't believe what they're seeing, what they're hearing. The sound of it is uh, something that's completely different than any other instrument. An instrument designed to make those cold March Mayville nights just a little bit warmer. It's a nice break for the winter time. In Dodge County, Adam Schrager, Fox 6 News.